I just had an insulting job interview. I sent an application to a company that repairs Connex containers as they were looking for a welder and I happened to be one. I got there and was shown around the shop. Since the hall where the containers were being repaired was too small they did most of their work outdoors, the whole year no matter the temperature's leather. This had me raise an eyebrow. 10 however, the highlight of the interview, I would earn about $16 an hour and work 45 hours a week. 10 the interviewer then complained to me 23 years old that he was disappointed that the young people weren't willing to work anymore. 10 I'm still in doubt whether to laugh or cry. Reminds me of this guy goes to a welding job interview and the salary range is listed as $15.40 an hour. They ask for some practice welds and the guy does two separate pieces. One is perfect, and the other one looks like a bowl of popcorn. The interviewer asked what the heck is this? Why are they so different? The guy points to the crap job and says that's a 15 an hour job. The other one is 40 an hour. Forklift driver here, can't find forklift work over $16 either, I also have a chauffeur's license. No one is willing to pay livable wages these days. Companies will never change this mindset until we stand up against them. They probably haven't been hiring ever since 15 bucks was decent money. For reference minimum wage in my region is 15 hours, like teenagers stocking dollar store shelves. Problem is, with that pay you're competing with McDonald's for workers and McDonald's looks like the better gig. Show him what a $16 an hour weld looks like compared to a $20 and a $25 an hour weld. Let him make the decision. If they're only offering $16 under those conditions no wonder no one wants to work. This ain't rocket science. I'd think you'd make more as a welder than that. I hate when they don't put pay rate in the job description. I won't even show up to an interview until I know it's worth my time. I'm not gonna waste 30 minutes of both our time for you to offer me a wage a high schooler could get at a fast food restaurant. I make 19 hours stocking shelves at Target, $16 for something as difficult as welding is absurd. I worked off-site at a large research laboratory a few years ago and they had opening for postdocs paying £13,900 a year. I often wondered what the candidates were like, bearing in mind I worked with a couple of on a telescope project who didn't know what Pythagoras's their om was. Oof. Company is utterly out of touch. So let me rephrase this would you or anyone in their right mind be willing to waste 8 hours of their 16 hours a day provided that they sleep 8 hours for insultingly low wages just to make some rich fuck even richer? Yes, I'm a go with hell no, too. Especially welding Lamau, that's tough as hell. Dunno why trades are looked down upon societally, those things are hard to do. I think there is a cause and effect these people are missing. Have we ever considered people don't want to work because employers don't want to pay? $16 HR would have been fined 20 years ago for a skilled welder position. However $16 HR now does not mean shit and you can get $15 HR from McDonald's. Personally I take working in the air conditioning. Dude I ride around on a reach forklift and listen to podcasts and music all day for 18.70. You should be making way more than me for welding. That dude can eat a dick lol. Nobody wants to work anymore. Notice how you never hear that from any company offering a good wage and benefit package. At my old job I was in the field and frequently around welders. They had a saying that there wasn't a shortage of welders, there was a shortage of welders willing to work for $12 an hour. Willing to be exploited anymore. I'm sorry, I can't work for you. In these 30 minutes I realized that I don't like you a single bit. Actually, I think I already hate you. Please refrain from contacting me again. I used to be a welder. I would flat out refuse to take a job under $30 an hour. $16 hour is gas station wages around here. $16 hour as a welder? F that, go union bro. You tell him young people are willing to work, just not for shit wages.
they need to hear this over and over and over. Gif Gif E307 Ekloib JLX Pinsu Downsized $16 hour to be in the rain and extreme heat. LOL $16 for welding holy shit no one wants to work anymore holy lol This is why I tell everyone I know to fight for unions. I make $25 an hour, in an area where that's really good money. We get a raise every November. Is my work perfect? Absolutely not. But I know I make what I should and everything the company can and can't do is right there in black and white. We're willing to work, but I can make $16 our flipping burgers at McDonald's. Welders make more than that. Every generation has bitched about these youths don't want to work since forever. The great gen said that about the silent gen, they said the same about the baby boomers, which they in turn say that about gen x and so on. All those assholes who think the solution for everyone is to go into the trades well, this kind of thing is also in the trades. Dude, fuck that job. I drive a forklift for Home Depot restocking lumber and I make $19. 50 hours. I make $25 hour as a baker. Inside with AC. Welders earn more than $16. This is not your job. Oh. 45 hours a week. Why? Because 40 simply wouldn't be enough? LOL. OP I hope you are able to find work that pays you more than $16 for your skills.